Hello everyone, Sunset Duck 2 and welcome to another data pack overview, this time on War from Bees, War Bees, a data pack that adds the ability for you to get resources from bees. Now, I've only just sort of learned a bit of the basics, so I'll just go mostly off of that and the information detailed here. So what you want to do is get yourself a beehive and then stand on top of it. Once you have one, just put one, say, over here, for example, and then stand on top of it, it'll then be labelled. I wasn't sure if you had to um, function first, then all these, and then put the command, I'm assuming you mostly just stand on top of it, and it'll be recognised as a beehive that can focus on aspects from the data pack. So just standing on top of it is fine. From there, it'll be labelled beehive, as you saw. And then from there you just hold a oak log or certain other things that are of a lower level of resources. And from there you want to breed them the typical way you'd be breed bees with flower. And then they'll have something like oak level 1 above it or something I guess like I've also tried is netherrack. That's also a level 1 related block. In your offhand. So if I just happen to do that now, I just... Clear the weather, set the time today, and just have two bees, not have blaze rods in my hands, or just have, say, white wool, for example. Just get a bee out there, read you and you, and it should have text above them saying that. So, wool level one, as you can see there, and that's as far as I've gotten so far from just sort of testing it out. Um, otherwise though, um, when breeding bees away from lower levels of bees, it is recommended to do that, um, rather than some others, to increase the level of the next baby bee. So if there is a level 1 bee and a lower one that's less than 6 blocks away, then you won't get the next level. So you want to keep going and just go say maybe two um, level 1 wool bees, um, rather I'm assuming than having say one level 1 gravel and one level 1 sand um, too often, but you will mostly, I'm assuming, if you have already ones that are at level 5 of that and doing it, rather than lower levels. Um, and I don't know if all of them can be combined. I'm pretty sure a fair amount of them can be, as you can see here, um, but when it comes to, say, a level 3 versus a level 2, say, oak and netherrack, I'm not sure how well that goes. Um, it probably won't convert them like it's expecting level 5 of both of them, but yeah. So the hive will, hive will change to the level of the bee in the first data slot of the MBT data in the hive. So any bees that are in slots 2 and 3 will change to the same level um, rather than being their prior levels that they were. I'm assuming that will mean if they're of a lower level rather than a higher one, but I don't know if that means that if they are a lower level and they happen to be in the first slot it will reduce them, I don't know. Hoping that's not the case, but uh, yeah, I'm assuming that the higher the level it will probably focus on those, um, but I'm not too sure. Um, but otherwise, separate your bees if need be. Um, other than that, higher tier bees will need to be bred with two others of higher level, and for example if you're using an iron nugget bee and it will breed with a level 5 and otherwise, when holding it in your offhand, oh, when doing said things like that, sorry, um, not an exception type or warning type thing like I was thinking of reading it as, um, so the level of your bee will go up to diamond by cross beating level 5 bees of that sort. So yeah, other than that though, thanks so much for watching and goodbye.